Hello, Tales for Tots friends. Guess what? It's time. That's right. We're going to read a very special book today. But before we do that, do you remember what we always do? That's right. We do our Mazza letters. So first, let's learn how to do our letters with sign language. Take your hand up. We're going to fold those three long fingers over. Boom. That's our M. And then we're going to make a fist. And that's our A. And then remember how we make a Z? <gasps> There it goes, right in the air, and another Z, and boom, there's our A. So you're ready? M-A-Z-Z-A. -Z -Z -A. You got it. Now, hmm, oh, that's right. We have our Mazza song, so let's sing it together. If you've never sung it before, that's okay. Just follow the words at the top, or next time sing it with us. So you're ready? Okay, here we go. The more you come to ready, Mazza, to Mazza, to Mazza. The more you come to Mazza, the happier you'll be. Why? Because your friends are my friends, and my friends are your friends. The more you come to Mazza, the happier you'll be. Good job. Now, let me reach down in my magic bag and look at the book we're going to read today. The Very Noisy Bear by Nick Bland. In this book, you're gonna to learn to make a microphone. And all you're gonna need is a pine cone and a stick. Well, actually, you'll need one more thing. Maybe you have some Play-Doh at home. I'm gonna take a scoop of my Play-Doh out, squish it up, and I'm gonna push it right here on the end of my pine cone. Then I'm gonna take this stick and I'm gonna push it in. La la, I have my microphone. The Very Noisy Bear by Nick Bland. In the jingy, the jangy jungle where music's in the air. ears of a very sleepy bear. <sighs> Excuse me, said the bear to the music-making sheep. Your band is very noisy and it's time for me to sleep. Now that you're awake, said sheep, perhaps you'd like to stay. Have you ever tried the jungle drums? They're really fun to play. Lion was on the jungle drums and Bear began to smile. I suppose if I could play the drums, I'd stay for a while. He sat upon the tiny stool. Boom, bang, bash, boom, went the noisy bear. It's harder than it looks, said Lion, to play the jungle drums. You might prefer an instrument that you only have to strum. Zebra had a striped guitar. She handed it to Bear. Hold it over here, she said, and you strum it over there. Bear started strumming gently, but it wasn't very loud. Then he strummed a little harder so the sound could reach the crowd. But his claws were long and curly and they tangled in the strings. Never mind, said Zebra. Guitars are tricky things. Goose held up his trumpet. Would you like to have a go? All you have to do, he said, is take a breath and blow. Bear took a giant breath and blew with all his might. The trumpet made a screeching noise and all the birds took flight. The 
elephant stampeded and the monkeys left. Screech! Everyone took cover until Bear was out of breath. Your lungs are awful strong, said Sheep. You must be very proud. But there is another instrument that isn't quite as loud. Have you ever tried a microphone? It's just a simple thing. You only have to hold it up, clear your throat, and sing. She handed Bear the microphone and counted up to four. The band began to play a tune, and Bear began to roar. Roar went the noisy bear. Roar, roar, roar. More cheered the audience. More, more, more. The elephants were dancing and the monkeys sang out loud. He roared in perfect harmony through every single song. Then when the show was over and the moon had settled in, when everyone was fast asleep, he tried the violin. 